I have, I'd like to share one last yeah. story, and this is, came to us in 2012. At the beginning of the 2012, we heard the following story uh, from a shaman, a Mexican shaman in mm -hmm. Italy. And uh, our understanding is that at the beginning, uh, in January, at the beginning of the year 2012, which was a big year, mm -hmm. the elders of the Mexican shamans got together and they went into their retreat. And after three days in their retreat, in their visions, they came out with three visions. And one of those visions they announced as being to go out and find the light priestess of the highest order of Melchizedek who was working with the light crystals of the New Age. That was the message. That was wow. the quote. So one of their shamans got on a plane and basically flew to Europe, flew to Italy, flew to a town and found where there was a show taking place where the light crystals were without were these knowing. Like and one of the Litio's partners, one of the women, she's very clairvoyant and very, very um, a powerful healer, mm -hmm. she had them all here. And he came to the stand, to the booth, and he saw the crystals. And he took one of the pennants in his hand, and it happened to be the dolphin pennant, mm -hmm. and he went into ecstasy. And he was totally blissed out and laughing and in ecstasy, and he put it down, and then he would bend back, and then he would do it again. So he was very, very moved and very connected to the divine light. And he explained that the Mexican shamans have a very strong connection with the water beings of Sirius. Wow. So he took several with him, and uh, we haven't heard from them since then. <laughs> but they found the light crystals of the New Age, the Mexican shamans, the Council of the Elders. 